We are on Mondays, super excited, super happy to be here. And we're just so fortunate that we have today and Wednesday together again. And I really, really, really hope to have more of you um, joining in to, on Wednesday. How would that, how good would that be? How good would that be? All right. Last little link in. Over there. Technology, just trying to figure out where everything goes. Except that one's going to be annoying. Okay. All right, Groovers. Who's ready? All right, here we go. All right, so I'm not streaming to my group today. I'm just doing it here with you guys. I've got a counter on here because one thing we know, Shana's really bad at counting. I lose myself uh, very easily, very frequently, which is totally fine because I just get too excited and in the moment. And what I wanted to do was have a timer for me so that I remember the time. Okay guys, so today's workout, I'm a little bit more full of energy at the moment than I was the last couple of weeks because recent it's finished. So today's workout, whole body. We're using everything. We're gonna do our typical warm up of our inchworms, our body weight exercises. Then we're getting into our seven one minute workouts. We're gonna go through them twice. And by that, you should be puffing and panting quite nicely. Um, I did have a water bottle here, but it vanished, which is absolutely fine. So I'm gonna get one of these later. All right, so a warm up guys, who's ready? Let's warm up together. Uh, let's do some inch worms. We're just gonna do five inch worms for me, okay? So big shoulder width apart. Here you bending over, walking out. All the way down to the ground, touch the ground, come back up, walk it up, walk. come back down, all the way, walk it all the way down, touch, come back up, walk it back, walk it back, walk it back, stretch through the back of the legs, flip your way up, open up, squeeze the bum, coming down, all the way down and out, touch, come back up. Walk it all the way up. Good. Always there, touch. All the way down, touch. Come back up. Walk it all the way up. Roll it out. All right, guys. Let's go with some front leg swings. Get that mobility through the hips. I've been on the bike today, so this is muchly needed. Opening it up. Through the hip flexors. Two more ones. Two. Changing legs. Here, looking back, open out. Nice. I think I had way too big of a lunch. It's been quite heavy in my tummy. So if I can get through this workout today, you guys can too. All right, let's go across the body. Open it out. Really feel that movement through the hips. Last one. Let's change sides. Open it up. Kick it up, guys. Let's go rolling the arms forward. This is an interesting one. You really do get to see how tight your neck and shoulders are. And backwards. Rolling them back. And five jump squats, guys. 
Touch the ground and come back up. Let's go up. One, two, three, four, five. How good does the body feel? I now know why I just figured it out why I'm all four. Because I've been practicing a whole lot of squats and deadlifts from home the last couple of days. I've been in this uh, lower body mania trying to, I think I've been watching too many of these video clips with all these booty girls and looking at all these uh, leggings, wanting to buy leggings at the moment. And uh, those pictures aren't fair. They just motivate me to do more squats. All right, guys. So today's workout is one minute of step ups. One minute. Going through step ups, I'm just going to shrink this screen just in case some of you are on the Facebook group instead. Just had that hindsight thought. Good. All right, so if some of you are on there, I'm just going to be paying attention as well. All right. Mm -mm -mm. Well, that's not doing what I expected it to. That's fun. All right, so coming into it, our training is one minute of step up. I've got a step here. You could use a kitchen step, I'm sorry, a kitchen chair. You could be using, I'm trying to pick the screen. You could be using a kitchen chair, a ladder, um, an outdoor furniture piece, whatever you might need, maybe a garden bed to use for your step ups. It's one minute. Then we're going straight into push ups for one minute. You can choose whether they are wide, narrow, neutral, diamond, whichever way you want. Then we're going into lunges. Now I want you guys to do alternating lunges. So just stepping forward, bounce back, stepping forward, bounce back. Maybe you want to go out to the sides wider. I'm going to let you guys choose that for yourself. Then we're going into one minute of inch work. We did this in the warm up, walking our way out, walking our way back in for a whole minute. Water bottle leg raises. Now these, I'm going to use the dumbbell because I forgot my water bottle. You can use a, a, a water bottle or anything at home. It will be from here, brace yourself back, and we're going to take, when we close enough, you have to lift your legs over it. So from here, up, up, up. And you can tap the ground if you want to, or keep your feet suspended. Up, here you go, side to side. <laughs> Whichever way you want to go, okay? For a minute. And then it will be, um, oh, this is going to be difficult for me. I'm going to have to have a lighter one. But plank passes. So plank pass will be in the plank position. And you know, from one side, you're going to pass to the other. Come back, hold the plank, grab it, pass to the other side. Okay, so it's just passing it either side of yourself whilst holding a stage four plank, which is stage four plank is this position here. Okay. Any questions, shoot them through. She might be able to do that, that's fine. Are we ready guys? Ready to get going? Who's joining in from home? Are we joining in from Facebook land or are we joining in? Excellent, okay. Okay, so start off with a proper burpee. And then digress, regress, set, let's go. Jump, come down, touch the ground, jump up, jump, come down, touch the ground, jump. If you need your regress, jump, touch the ground, set your feet back, set your feet in, stand up, and jump. Whichever one you feel better at, jump, down, push up, jump up, from here, push up. You're going quick, you should be able to go straight from a jump, straight into your push up and catch yourself, throw your feet back in and jump nice and high. All body, let's go. 12 seconds, go. Jump high, come on, two more. Up, jump high. Last one. Ooh. Saved by the bell, guys. Woo. If you're an activator or a connector, I challenge you to give me 10 star jumps and then you can rest with the rest of us. Woo. Does that make sense to you guys? If you don't know what an activator or a sensor is, 
that's fine. You probably haven't been introduced to the PH60 program yet and had your profile done, which is absolutely fine. You've got time to explore that. Reach out to one of our coaches and ask about understanding your phenotype. But in the meantime, we're still doing a good workout. Some of you might have heard, oh, keep talking. Some of you might have heard of the terminology of the endomorph and ectomorph and mesomorph. So I'm an endomorph and we're the ones that are slow and steady wins the race. Ectomorphs are more logical thinking and they probably wouldn't be doing this workout anyway because they're probably getting ready to be up nice and early and uh, on a push bike or something like that or doing some sort of a analytical program. Uh, the uh, mesomorphs, which we call connectors and activators, you guys are the short, fiery, aggressive, love a challenge. You guys will be training in the morning, but you guys will also be here in the afternoon loving to be challenged and constantly moving. And you guys may need far less um, rest than what the endomorphs do. So that's why you'll hear me. You'll see me being like, activators and connectors, you keep going. I'm going to catch my breath. <laughs> All right, guys, round two. Everybody? Go, so step up. One minute, step up. Let's do this. Set and go. All the way up. So this time, last time I stepped back, this time I'm going to step down. So setting my body up, tap my foot back, tap my foot back. Same movement, but being driven by a different position and the force is coming from a different spot. So we're using different muscles, in, the same muscles in a different way. Always squeeze up, bum up, bum up. Halfway, 30 seconds. Nice and tall. Gosh, it's getting dark outside early, isn't it? Whew. 15 seconds. Push through, guys. Good job, guys. Good job. You remember what's next? Push ups. Let's do it, guys. Let's get it finished. Still in those push ups. Set. And let's go. One minute on the clock. All the way down, all the way up. I was about to say my push-ups are getting better. I don't know about yours, but I also did a bucket load of push-ups the last couple of days over the weekend. So I'm a little less able right now, but I'm still here going through the movement, pushing through. Squeeze the shoulder blades down and back. All the way down, touch the ground, come all the way up. Touch the ground. All the way up. Last 20 seconds, guys. Push. Keep the momentum. Keep it going. Up. Let's go 10 seconds. Up, 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 up. Let's go three, two, one. Done. Good job. Good job. Lunges, guys. Now know what you're doing, let's push it through, let's go lunges, and away we go. Nice. Let's go backwards. Dirty lunge. Dirty lunge. Lunge back. I get to see the instructional video on lunges the other day. I just did the wrong thing and went behind myself too far and gave myself nothing to balance on. 20 seconds to go, guys. Do one legged backwards and forwards. Backwards lunge. Straight into a forward lunge. Back. Change legs. Backwards lunge. Tap. Forward lunge. Come back. Five seconds, guys. Forward lunge, come back, change legs, backward lunge, Woo. tap, forward lunge, we're done. Next movement, inchworms, 
Cool, yeah, this one is one set. Let's go, guys. In front, from here, breathing down, all the way out. Touch, coming up, walk it back, standing tall. Down, touch, walk it out, all the way down, coming up, walking it back, rolling the spine. Walk it back up, 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 up. Nice. Up, back. Push it back, 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 back. Standing up. Four seconds to go. How many more can you do? Standing up tall. Nice. Last one. Nice. All right, now we have the water bottles. Over the water bottle. Set it up. Find your balance. And let's go. One side to the other. Step away. Tap over. Tap over. See how much time we've got left. Push them through. All right. Over halfway. Come on, keep going. Ooh, make sure you're in a comfortable spot on your backside or else you end up feeling on your coxie bones. Put them up down if you need it. 15 seconds. Keep it up, guys. Keep it up. Five, four, three, two, one, done. Must be down. Off to the side. From here. Let's go. Passing it through. Nice and wide. Pass that side of the hand. Pass that side of the hand. Good. Passing. Passing. Halfway. Oh, I almost got my finger. Nice. Come on, guys. Last 15 seconds. Hold strong. My watch is telling me to move. I don't think my watch is calibrated correctly. It's telling me I'm not moving enough. One, done. Oh my gosh. Last move, guys. All right, burpees. Let's follow this popcorn stand, guys. Burpees, one minute, let's go. Touch. Jump up. Jump up. Come down. Touch your chest. Come up. Bring the feet in. Punch your can. Then you step it out. Come down. Step out. Step in. Bring yourself up. And jump. Okay? That's your regression. Coming down. Jumping. Pressing. Keep that core tight. Coming down. Jump. Hi. Halfway's gone. Up. Hi. Good. Come down. Up. Press. Good, 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 good. Let's keep it up. Down. Two more. Come on. Up. Last one. Touch. Up. And jump. Yes. I don't know about you guys. That was pretty epic. Uh, Job. Well done. 
And my watch is letting me down. My watch is telling me I haven't worked out. All lies. All lies. Guys, so last week, thank you for joining in with me. I hope you've been enjoying the workouts. Uh, Wednesday's our last one. Please, please, please let us know what would you like to see more of, guys. Wednesday will be our last workout together. What would you like to do for a workout with me to celebrate the end of an era, the end of a turn, the end of this connection that we've had? What would you guys like to see? Remember to stretch, guys. Let's go do some stretching. All right, bring one foot up. Kick it through. You must have to admit, we always feel better when we do this exercise. You might not want to when you first start it. Even me, I have plenty of days where I don't want to train. But I know I do this step. Like I'm keeping nice and tall, core tight, bum tight, and just ever so slight, ever so slight pivot forward. Bring those toes back. You feel that at the back of your legs. We don't need to be reaching for our toes. Nice and tall, slight pivot forward, stretch through the back. Let me down and change legs. Right, pivot forward, nice and tight in the belly. Lean into it. Stretch, guys, good stretch. Down. How's those shoulders feeling? Go to a shoulder stretch. I know it's dark outside, but uh, hopefully some of you are or have or will go for a walk. Enjoy this fresh air. From here, let's take your hands back, clasp them together, interlace them, and let's stretch them forward, pivoting at the hips. Stretching it out side to side. Let your arms drop forward as far as they can. Bring your arms down. Let them hang. Stretching through the upper back. Let your hands hang. Just hang there for a second. Deep breath. And then slowly come up. That's the tall. How's that, guys? Sweaty Amazonians? Yes, let's do that. All right, guys, have a wonderful Wednesday night. Whatever you're watching the replay, give us a hashtag replay or a comment saying you're watching the replay so we know when you're tuning in. And uh, make sure you're on in the morning for yoga um, and with Ike as well. Your morning yogas, your morning um, Tabata sessions with Ike. Um, and then we have Wednesday, 5.30 p.m. Come and join us, guys.